Hello, hello, hello! It's us again! And this is the last one we're doing together on this trip, so... I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> this is Grandma Bev from Life with Grandma Bev and my daughter Michelle from Hi. Michelle Escalin and Books Cause Insomnia. So she has two channels and I'll put the link for them down below. Those of us who, uh, uh, those of you who are not familiar with us, we're mother and daughter. We don't live near each other. So we get together maybe once, twice a year sometimes. And we go thrifting. And TJ Maxx. You know, some new places too. So a lot of you are subscribed to both our channels. Now she's going... Mm -mm. Oh, I was just going to say, <laughs> this is a TJ Maxx and Home Goods store. It's right. They have it all in one store where we went. It's combined. I mean, yeah. you can walk from one, you're in the other. And... Uh, <laughs> she's going to do a vlog on our travels on her channel and I think you've got a picture of that TJ Maxx store Just, I don't know if she'll put it on it but yes I will it's a combo and uh, I was chuckling because we've got such a mess out here from doing all these videos and her husband just comes down and walks walks through so he sees all this he probably thinks, what did they do oh my god <laughs> what do they spend i don't want bob to say all this <laughs> <laughs> i want to condense it all down to smaller you know maybe two bags so i just <laughs> wonder what i spent which we didn't spend a lot no. really not really at all i think tj maxx is where i spent the most because oh by that's, far that's me new too stuff you know <laughs> Otherwise, everything else was all thrift stores. So anyway, moving on. Did you have anything else to add before we start showing our goods? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Those of you who are, are new to my channel, what you see is what you get. I don't edit out things. So, it's not fake. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, I'll start here. You want me to start? Yeah. <laughs> I thought this was just precious. Look at that. It's an Isaac Miss Rahi. I open it up, and inside is a little pill box. <laughs> I just thought that was so cute. I bought it for its cuteness. I, I won't use it for a pill box, I'm sure, because I've got to bring a lot more than this little teeny amount when I go on trips. So th this was, oh, uh, let's see. $4.99. Then I specifically wanted to go to TJ Maxx because when I'm in Yuma, there isn't one. And that's where I like to buy a lot of the palettes and, and things like that that, that I sent to um, you know, this one gal who does stuff for homeless gals and victims of domestic abuse. So I wanted to go and find some good stuff. First, there's this vanilla peach truffle. I'll quick show you what's inside. Isn't that pretty? Oh, yeah. So that's that one. And that was uh, $4.99. I dropped a little cover, but I don't know where it went. Oh, I see it. Do you want it now or you want to no, wait? No, we'll get it. <laughs> I see it. That's the important part. <laughs> do all the these things together <laughs> then I thought this was so pretty it's take me back to Brazil and uh, this was on a clearance course but look at all those gorgeous colors and that was on sale for seven dollars instead of I think I saw one that it wasn't marked on sale, just like it, and it had been like 10 or something like that. And here's a cute little one. <laughs> it's called Fantasy Palette Volume 2 from Dragoon Beauty, D-R-A-G-U-N. Oh, inside this, I just love this. It says on the mirror, who's the baddest of them all? But we'll move that so you don't have that. But look at those. Aren't those pretty? And they're like in the shape of teardrops or eggs. Probably like dragon eggs. Yeah. And the colors were like baked, batty, ditzy. 
Sailor Dragon, Dragon Aquarius, and Hexus Girl. Kind of reminds me of maybe something from, you know, Game of Thrones. That's what I was thinking. Maybe it's a Game of Thrones inspired. Yeah. And this was $6.99. It wasn't on sale, but I just thought it was so pretty. Uh, let's see. And then one more palette. It's called Nudes Chocolate. I love Revolution Nudes Chocolate. And that one is $3.99. <laughs> open it from the bottom end. So Michelle grabs it, whips it all the way to it. Because <laughs> I'm so slow at doing things. And see, it looks like that, like a chocolate bar and a chocolate dripping. And inside. Isn't that pretty? Oh, that's it on the palettes for the eyes. And I found this cute little bag. I'm not sure. I might keep this one. <laughs> I don't know. But they had to go find a price for me. I don't remember what it was. But so I think it was a little more than what I typically spend. Then one of my main reasons was I wanted to go in and, and also get different masks. Masks. <laughs> Here's one, Skin Aesthetics ex Exfoliated Foot mask, Masks in Mint and Tea Tree. And there are three in there. And I paid $3, so about a, a buck each. That's less than Dollar Tree now. And I've had this one before. And I had taken it on a trip with me and put it on my feet at night. It's three of them. And they're a Cala Sea Salt Moisturizing Foot Masks. Three dollars, so a dollar each. And then this one I got, and some of my friends on here who are with the Mask Monday Ladies Club, it's a snail mask. So if anybody wants to join me in doing a Mask Monday Ladies with the snail mask, let me know. Now we can see how many are in here. Gosh, <laughs> we had a lot of fun trying to we guess. We wanted to peek and it doesn't say anywhere on there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So it was ten, like, like we thought. Right? Like we thought it might be. So ten of the masks, and this was <laughs> four dollars. Now that's a bargain. Yeah. And quite a few months ago, a bunch of us did try a snail mask, and we really liked them. So when I saw them, I, I'm getting them. So like I say, any of, of you gals who want to join me on a Monday doing those masks, let me know. Oh, it's not going decadent. Mm -hmm. Let me show this one first. It's, <laughs> this is another one. Cer Ceramide, Ceramide, Caffeine Essence Masks. Sheet masks for the face. And these have 10. And this one was $6.99, so $7. Not even a dollar a mask. And the last goodie is... Oops, it opened. <laughs> Loaded, Did you do that? <laughs> no. Loaded and chunky are white chocolate cranberry super chunk cookies. Now, these just caught my eye. Mm -hmm. Now, I would normally ever pay this much for cookies. It was $3.99. Because I always buy all my junk in Dollar Tree. Well, don't get Girl Scout cookies then. No, 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 no way. <laughs> so that does it on mine. Now, what did I spend? I think I spent $60. So, of course, I'm going to be spending more there because they're regular price items. They're not in the goodwill. So, that's mine. You want to take over? Sure. I spent a lot. <laughs> <laughs> but we just moved, so need some extra stuff for around the house. Ugh. I got this. <laughs> it's a bamboo... Shoe sand, stand, shoe sand. Yeah, I guess you could get sand in your shoes. <laughs> yeah. It was uh, $29.99 for it. If you don't drag it through the house, the sand will just fall on the ground right there. That's right. And then, no, that, that, uh, blah, 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 blah. that <laughs> last item and this were both in the home good side. I think. Well, okay, a couple other things were too, but 
Um, I got these glasses. I, I am so in love with um, this show, The Mandalorian, and especially this little guy here, Grogu. And I just, I had to have these glasses. So these were $14.99 for four of them. So will you quit rattling those bags? <laughs> I broke. Did you drop something? Oh, just one of these. I'm trying to make more room here. <laughs> okay. Um, I got maple brown sugar coffee. And it was $5.99, which... Good price. Lately, coffee's been so yeah. expensive. Actually, let's see. I got some towels for my kitchen. Ooh. Well, this will go great with the, one of the things she got at Goodwill. Yeah, I've, I've been kind of into this fruit and vegetable look lately. Um... And the brand is Cupcakes and Cashmere. I spent $6.99 on these. And it says that these are green. They were made. Oh. Green. So I guess maybe <laughs> they're a lot of green on them. made out of recycled material or something. But it does say made in green, which I know means that they were. Or maybe, you know, they used... I don't know, less harmful things to make them or something. <laughs> then I got a eyeshadow palette. I Heart Revolution peaches, or chocolate and peaches. I thought it was peaches and cream. Yeah. That sounds better, but. Here's the colors. <laughs> Get nice and close so you can see them. To me, these are the perfect spring and summer colors, though. What are their names? Oh, delicious fruit, sweet candy, rich peach. Nothing too exciting for the names, but... Then I got Ice Baby... Highlighter. Did I say how much that was? I don't think I did. It was $6.99 for that eyeshadow. And then I got Ice Baby Pacifica Mineral Highlighter with Coconut Water. And it was $3.99. You know what? I'm going to keep this so it doesn't matter. Just rip it open. Yeah. <laughs> I know we try to be so careful. It doesn't really matter. <laughs> and here's... What that one looks like. It's an ice, ice baby. Yeah. That'll be in my head now. Vanilla. Right. I got two of these facial scrubbers for $3.99. Brad and I really like those. Mm -hmm. I think, are these antimicrobial? No. Okay. But you can wash these on the top rack of your dishwasher if you ever use those. I just find they get into my pores really nicely. Yeah, well, Brad, I would think, with having a little beard. Oh, yeah, he loves using yeah, it. Yeah, between the, you know, the hairs. And... I got this body spray, Paris Hilton's Eris. And that was six ninety nine, and it's got a really nice scent to it. It's kind of floral with maybe a, a floral musk now in there can, too. Now we can spray it. <laughs> yeah, it's We're very trying pretty. to smell it through the bottle and <laughs> two choices. Um, then I got these Spongibles Petty Scrub in a sponge. And it says they, um, they last for 20 washes in the shower. So I thought that was pretty nice. I got this one, which is Coconut colada, Ooh. and I got Ocean Breeze. Coconut colada sounds good. Yeah, and those are three ninety nine each. But I yeah I thought this this um, Ocean Breeze would be nice for the spring, and then the Pina colada would be nice for the summer. I should have looked at them and gotten some. <laughs> I was wondering why you weren't looking at them. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then I got the um, Nivea Black and White Invisible Active Antibacterial 48-Hour 
deodorant. And this is $3.99. And it's it's not natural. I use usually always use natural deodorant. However, I found that when I go to the gym, <laughs> natural deodorant doesn't cut it. So I have to use this when I work out. And I spent, I hope he can't hear me. <laughs> that's what i spent our voices can travel up the stairs yeah <laughs> and that's everything i got so that's it is that everything now that we yeah after we're down here we'll probably discover a bag or something right oh uh, shoot the whole bag <laughs> and then of course here and there we stop and got things to eat <laughs> yeah I mean, so we did all this damage in three days. We didn't start until the afternoons because we're not morning people. Right. And uh, in the heat. <laughs> yeah. So we got a lot done. I think I uh, sat for a while as far as going traipsing around again. <laughs> oh, yeah. We did two the first night. We got together quite a bit later the first the first day. And then we did four yesterday and then two today. And that... That was plenty. I don't think I'll be going to a thrift shop anytime soon. <laughs> and of course, they're not all near each other, so no. we're driving them all town, you know, all across town and everywhere. And yeah, that's something people don't realize. Vegas is huge. It's spread out. It's very, very, very big. Quite a few. I don't even know how many miles of square feet it, or square square miles it is, but it is. It takes about forty five minutes. To drive in any direction from one end to the other. Providing no traffic. You're right, yeah. If you go anywhere down there where the casinos are, you're going to hit bad traffic. And we didn't even really go down there, but mm -mm. one part of the freeway kind of gets that way. Yeah. Anyway, I think that'll do it then. Yeah. So please comment down below. Share, like, <laughs> subscribe. And I do appreciate your comments, but keep them nice. If they're nasty, keep them to yourself. You know, <laughs> okay. show a little respect. <laughs> <laughs> so I hope you're all having a good week. Like I say, I will put links to Michelle's two channels down below, and uh, look for her vlog where you may hear an interesting conversation. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I hope you're all having a terrific week. I love you all. And you love them too, right? I love you. Yeah. <laughs> Bye.